Rogers Center is going to be packed on Sunday. That's when the Bills take on the Falcons at Rogers Center. Joining me now, Greg Albrecht, Executive Director of Bills in Toronto in its sixth year. Sixth year. Uh, this is huge. I know ticket sales have been going great. A lot of excitement around the day. But even in the morning, there's a lot going on, starting with we've got the pregame party. Pre-game party on Front Street, front mm -hmm. between John and Blue Jay Way. Uh, we have uh, a fully licensed area. We've got interactive games. We've got lots of sponsors on the street. We've got a main stage act. We've got two of them, actually, uh, Rob Carnegie and uh, Fathead. So a lot, a lot of R&B, a lot of country. So mm -hmm. to pump you up before the game. But even before that happens, up at Young Dundas Square, um, Omni is presenting uh, Football 101. So if okay. you don't know anything about football, if you are uh, new to the game, mm -hmm. uh, and we're reaching out to the multicultural community in, in Toronto, uh, come on down to Young Dundas Square between 11 and 4, and touch the ball, learn about the plays, learn about the game, learn about the terminology. The so you know what you're talking about when yeah. you actually go or when you watch it on TV if you're having a party. That's um, it. It's great for kids too, the 101. Uh... Yeah, it's a free event. Yes. Uh, so it's a really great, great place to come down with families. And if you want to come down with your family and then go shopping and then everybody else can stay at uh, Young Dundas Square and learn about the game, that'd be great. Mm -hmm. And then go down to the game at 4 o'clock. So kickoff's at 4.06. There is so much buzz. There's always so much excitement when the Bills are here. What is it that you think it is that, that fans love? Well, I think it's just the game itself. I mean, this year uh, the Bills have been doing relatively well. Every game has been really exciting. Uh, and we've been here for six years now. So uh, there's, there's a there's a sense of uh, um, anticipation about the game yeah. and uh, this year they're just you know it's gonna be a really fun game with the Falcons and uh, with our Omni 101 as well as the pregame event and our halftime show okay we've got to talk about the halftime show because I'm a dork I'm really excited about the Beach Boys performing and there's actually a chance for viewers to get up close and personal with the Beach Boys, right? That's right, yep. You can actually register um, as a participant for the halftime show as long as you have a ticket to the game. Yes. Uh, Toronto Bills at prpconnect.com mm -hmm. and go up to that website or go to that email address and register yourself and uh, you, can, you can be part of the halftime show. Now, we have a contest. Before I talk about the contest, I do want to mention the business symposium that is happening on the Monday. Right. Um, some big names, some great names and a lot going on there. Yeah, Lieutenant Governor Duffy is a U.S. Uh, a keynote speaker. He's He's, um, he's a governor of, um, of um, a left-hand governor of New York. Yep. Uh, Tim Hudak, who's leader of the opposition, is our is our Canadian keynote speaker. And it's all about bringing football and business together. So if you register for that event, uh, which is called the Cross Border Huddle, mm -hmm. uh, you go like to the that. game on Sunday, and then you go to Real Sports for a half-day symposium with a lot of talk about international trade, immigration, labor mobility, things like that. So it's really about the business of football and sports, as well as expanding the businesses uh, down to the states. Good stuff. Let's get back to the business the Beach Boys okay <laughs> so here it is and this is how you can win we've got two of these collector edition Beach Boys box sets all you need to do to win is email contests at bttoronto.ca the first two emails you're gonna take this home there you have it Collected thank you edition. very much Greg and it's gonna be fun on it Sunday will be. it will be go Bills go Bills all right we're taking a break here don't forget Sunday Bills and Falcons will be right back here